Hey guys, Kevin here, and this is Pure Reviews, where I review all kinds of products. So if you are new to the channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And in particular, if you find this video useful or helpful, be sure to hit that like button before you go. Maybe leave a comment that says thanks. Those all really help out the channel a ton, and I greatly appreciate it. So today's product is available on Amazon, and I've included a link in the description that'll take you to the product page. You can see the current price point, see if it's on sale, all that lovely information. But what is it? So today's product I want to share with you is an automatic cat feeder by a company called Kando. This is what it looks like once you get it out of the box. It's also going to include an instruction manual that tells you how to operate it. We're going to cover a lot of those features right now. Uh, you will get a USB to USB type C uh, cable to power it up and a little adapter here that you will plug into a wall outlet. And then finally, you will obviously get a bowl. Uh, and the cat feeder itself. So first off, the little feeder bowl here, what's nice about it, it can be removed, so it makes it super easy to clean up. And then you can see there's this little nub right here that slides in on the bottom of the feeder, so that way it looks like so, and it keeps your cat, if you're batting this thing around and knocking it out of position. But why do you need an automatic cat feeder? So if you're like us and you do little weekend getaways or something like that, and you don't have necessarily a pet sitter, cats are pretty self-efficient. Um, and so these are just nice because you can schedule a feeding. Our cat is very food motivated. So it's really easy to schedule his feeding early in the morning at six o'clock. So he's not waking us up. It'll automatically feed. Uh, and he just sits there and he waits by his bowl. And then the same thing in the evening time when we feed him, or like I said, if we go away for a quick uh, day trip or have friends, uh, houses or something that we go to, then he always gets his feeding time right on schedule. So to give you an idea of what this automatic feeder can hold, it can hold up to four liters of cat food. And um, one of the cool things about it is it can do one to eight different meals a day. So you really have the flexibility. So if you like to feed your pets um, twice a day, you can do that. If you like to feed them four times a day, but give them smaller quantities to keep them from gorging themselves, you can do that. It's very, very flexible. Then it also allows you to do one to 10 portions. So the portion amount is obviously just going to tell you how much food it's putting out. So once again, very, very flexible. What I do recommend when you're setting up the portions, just so you get a visual idea of what a scoop is and everything, uh, just kind of add a portion at a time and run the machine. So that way you can see how much is going into the bowl before feeding them to get an idea if that's kind of what you are typically feeding your cat. Um, another cool feature you'll see right here, there is this little record button on the front. Uh, that's going to allow you to record a little message. Now, I don't really use this, but if you wanted, you can call in a message like calling your cat to the food bowl. Um, and it's like a 10 second little clip that can play every time it feeds uh, if you want. Now, you will notice right above there, there is a camera. So this does have a 1080p camera with night vision built into it. So going back to earlier where I said, you, you know, you may end up going on a weekend trip or something like that. You got an eyes on your pet. It's motion censored. It'll send you alerts. Uh, you can see them in the daytime. You can see them in the nighttime. So it's just a nice, good check. It's a good check to make sure the feeder's working um, and make sure that they're all happy while you are away. Um, it does also have built in, not only does it have the mic, but it does have built in two way audio. So you can listen to the surrounding area of what's going on. And uh, obviously, you can talk through the mic if you wish to do that. Uh, but the cat feeder is also kind of designed with an anti-clog situation here. So let's go over the device. Um, on the bottom here, you can see you have the speaker. You're going to have these little rubber pads here to keep it from sliding around. Uh, in this little door here, this is where you are going to plug in the USB Type-C to give it power. As you can see, it also does take standard battery. So if you are away and you have a power outage or anything like that, the device will continue to work, which is obviously important. So that way your pet is getting uh, plenty of food. On the front here, it does have a little feed button. So if you do want to manually press it, you can simply go by and press that button and it will manually spit out a portion of food. Uh, here is the slot where it goes down. At the very top is the reset button. Um, and then obviously in the middle is the camera that we already went over. Now on the top here, you can see it has these kind of little ear patterns. You're just going to twist this and move this off. 
It does have a little pouch up there in case you use a desanting patch, which will help absorb the moisture out of it. And then as you can see right in there, it has this nice large space for food which I mentioned it will hold up to four liters, but uh, it has this anti-clog design. Um, and how it's doing that is this little rubber wheel here just turns and it positions the food in the little disc there, and then it will slide over. So that way your food particles can't get stuck in keeps this from twisting. There are two separate independent devices. It is designed for food that is four to 12 millimeters in size. So if you have really large food, it's not gonna work for that. Um, it works though for standard cat food, um, dry cat food. So, but overall, it's a pretty cool device. So, if you are in the market for an automatic cat feeder, I think this one is totally worth checking out. If there's something that I didn't quite cover that you're a little curious about, feel free to hit me up in the comment section. I do typically respond to those. And that is it until the next video. You guys take it easy. Congrats, you made it to the end of the video. Thank you very much. Um, greatly appreciated for the support. Be sure to uh, hit that like button on the video. It really, really does help out. And if you have not subscribed yet, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and hit the notification bell if you want to uh, get notified when new videos come out on this channel.